Hola amigos, hola amigas, welcome, bienvenido, croissery, salam, welcome to the channel, y'all. Yakshimash, good day, and niho. Today we're going to be looking at something that takes us back to the very early 1980s, especially this, because this speak and spell is mine from when I was seven years old, or six years old. Yeah, I was six, I wasn't quite seven. This is my speak and spell from back then. Can you believe it? This was a Christmas present for Christmas 1981 going into 1982. Um, this was bought by my grandparents, my grandmother and my grandfather as a Christmas gift for myself and my sister. It was only a couple of months after we'd had the house fire and lost everything. Uh, we were staying next door to my grandparents in my auntie's house. And this is what they got us for Christmas that year. And I remember it so well. Unfortunately, the back has gone missing and it has been missing for some years, which is a bit of a shame. But yeah, this is this is something that takes you back. It's it also if you remember the movie E.T., this was featured in E.T. Now, this was the speak and spell. There was also a speak and math. Um, and I think there was another one. Now, let me go back into the Argos catalogue for that year and find out the price. Because I think it was around £45. But let me just double check. So here I have the Argos uh, catalogue from 1982. So I'm going to flick through and I'm going to find what we're looking for. Okay, so I found it. I'll stick a picture up now of it. I've taken a screenshot. I'll put that up. Um, Texas Instruments, Speak and Spell, Electronic Learning Aid. I was a fun whilst learning to spell with Electronic Voice Computer Brain. Added games for the whole family. Operates four batteries, blah, blah, blah. £33.95. So let me go into the inflation calculator. So that works out to be a hundred and twenty two pounds and seventy one pence today, which is still quite expensive, but still not compared to if you're gonna have like you know a gaming system or whatever they cost hundreds. This is just a speak and spell. This is as advanced as it got back in the day and unfortunately, it has got some marks on it. it needs a clean it's a bit manky here, so what i'm gonna do now i'm I'm gonna give it a clean and then we'll carry on and put some batteries in it. Now that looks a lot better that it's had a good clean, definitely. So what have we got? We've got battery compartment down here. We've got the DC power in. Uh, it doesn't say what it is. Texas Instruments, Electronic Learning Aid. Uh, assembled in Italy. And it's got the copyright here. Uh, 1979. Use alkaline batteries only. There is a little bit of corrosion there I can see on the uh I don't know if you can see there let's have a look see it's a little look little bit of corrosion it's a bit rough hmm let me get something for that okay I've got some IPA and I'm gonna pop there and I've got one of these uh carbon cleaning pens See that? And what I'm going to try and do is try and clean these with the IPA.
Okay, so that's actually cleaned it up quite a bit. That's really good. Let me put the batteries in for it that I have. That was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. Uh, let's switch it on. Oh, there we go. Let me turn the overhead light off because that screen isn't exactly um, bright, is it? Okay, so off, on, doodle did it. Uh, enter. I can't remember how to play it now. Spell A. Let's have a look. Mod select. No. Uh, go. Spell down. Was that town? T O W N. That is correct. Now spell yellow. Yellow. God, the voice sounds like. Y E L L O W. You are correct. Next spell brown. Was that brown? I think half the issue of this when I was a kid would have been understanding it. Winter? I wish this was a QWERTY keyboard. They should have done this as a QWERTY. K, that is correct. Now spell nine. Nine? N, I, N, E. You are correct. Next spell, mother. Maha. Mother. M O T H E R. That is right. Now try much. Much. M U C H. You are right. Try race. Race. R A C E. That is correct. Now spell after. 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 A F T E R. You are correct. Oh. Perfect score. Yay! 10 out of 10. Perfect score. Say it. What say it? Say it. Ball. Ball. Say it. How? How? Say it. That. That. Say it. Mother. Mother. Maha. Say it. Mook. Much. Oh, much. <laughs> Say it. Happy. Happy. Say it. Bring. 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 Say it. Star. Star. Say it. Sweet. Sweet. Say it. Door. Door. Spell ring. Bring. B. R. I. N. G. That is correct. Now spell star. S. T. A. R. You are correct. Next spell happy. Happy. Right, okay, so that's basically that. So. Um. How do I. Ah, right, okay. So I could go... F-C-U-K <laughs> Okay, or... Uh, right, okay, so we've got level A, B, C and D. Okay, D is the maximum. So if I do go... Guide, so this is the top... Guide. That is correct. Now spell young. 
Yong. Let's see if I can connect it up to my speaker so we get a better sound. I do remember this. I do remember the head, the the headphone jack that it came with. It was just a single one, so it was mono. It was only one like earbud um, that you connected into your ear. I do remember that. Okay. Uh, right. Where was I? I need repeat. Repeat. Yum. Oh God! Sounds worse. Okay. Why? No, turn you down. Oh. No, turn you down even more. You. N. G. You are correct. Let's spell elephant. Elephant. E. L. E. P. H. A. Uh. N. T. That is right. Now try it. Brought. Brought. B R O U G H T. You are right. Try referee. Referee. R E F E R E E. That is correct. Now spell scissors. Scissors, sisters. S C I S S O R S. You are correct. Let's go. Minute. What? So guide. So guide. Oh, did I just go back to replay rather than repeat? Guide. I did. <laughs> right, okay, so. What other things do we have on here? So if I go to on, we've got um, mystery word. Right, so this is like hangman. So we'll try A, A E, e I, I, O, U. U. Okay, clue. N. Oh, um, knife. Let's try K. K. N I yes. F E I win. Oh, knives. What did I do wrong? Okay, go. Oh, is that only one? We done say it. Secret code. O P I K. God knows what that is. I don't know how to play that mystery word letter. S -E -I. X. I. X. I. X. What? T. R. G. Oh, hang on. Um. Um. Uh, it was a raise. I saw it right oh, there we go. Oh. Let's try F I F H How am I supposed to know that? Anyway, I can't I don't really know how to use the other games, duh. But I the one that I do remember the most was um just trying to use it to learn how to spell. So considering that this is now <clears throat> 40 years old yes you heard it 40 years old it is still working as good as the day we had it which is a testament to speak and spell and also we really looked after this because we just had a i mean i know the back of it's being lost which is a bit of a shame but we really did look after this because we were just, you know, told it was very expensive and to take care of it. And as you can see, there's just some little scratches on it and stuff. But it's in excellent condition and working really well. And the screen is still working. Now, I can see here in the video, it's sort of like flickering a little bit. But when I'm looking at it, it's absolutely fine. It's just amazing. It's just... Amazing. Racing. R A C I N G. That is correct. Now spell 
Let's do it wrong. Uh, let's put it in wrong again. Was that toilet? Let's put in S H I T T E R Wrong Toilet. Let's try O G. That is incorrect. The correct spelling of toilet is T O I L E T. Toilet. Now try heavy. Heavy. I do wish that this had a way of um, typing in the words that you want to put into it and then pressing say. Because <laughs> that's just say it. Say it. Island. Island. What I wanted to do, which probably a good thing that it didn't, is to type words in and then make it say it. It doesn't do that, unfortunately, which is a bit of a shame. Um, so I can type in boobies, but it doesn't say it, unfortunately, which is a bit of a shame. So anyway, so there we go. That is it. I've been really looking forward to showing you guys this because... You know, this is not just something that I picked up. This is actually something that was mine as a child and still working, which is fantastic. Ah, I do hope it lasts another 40 years because probably by then it'll have to go into a museum. But I bet there are a lot of these still around, to be honest. I haven't um, looked for one on eBay or anything. Oh, actually, let's just out of curiosity, let me go on eBay. And have a look. Okay, so I'm just flicking through as we see. Um, there was a, a newer one. Um, that one is twenty seven ninety nine. Then we got forty nine ninety nine, fifty forty nine, fifty nine for the newer one. Seventy six there, fifty nine. And there's one thing I did notice when I was looking at this listing is that it has. I didn't realize you could get that was the little attachment uh, for the game. Let me go to the picture of it. There we go. Uh, homonym Heroes Word Module for Speak and Spell. And I was like, well, where on earth would that go? And then I had a look inside and you can see if I take out. Let me remove the batteries. Oop. OK, and if you look inside, you can just about see there. There's a connector board, so you'd put the module into here, this little module there. Slides in under there. And then you can see a board, and that's where it connects up. And you can do uh, different games with it. So not as uncommon. I mean, there weren't hundreds on eBay, but um, definitely you can buy one if you really wanted to. So I'm gonna wrap this back up in its tissue paper and um, put it back where it was because obviously that's it likes it there and it's still working. So fingers crossed. So I hope you've enjoyed. Thank you very much for sharing your time with me today on this. I really appreciate it. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye y'all.